everyone. Um, today's, uh, well, technically now it's Thursday, it's after midnight. Um, but I'm back <laughs> in my second video. I'm, I, I got over my jitters a little bit. Um, so I think I'm going to do a little bit better this time. Um, what's been going on today it was uh, very hot and humid in New Jersey and New York, the whole tri-state area. Um, they said the heat index from Mars town New Jersey, which is um, a little bit northwest of us, was 100 degrees. Um, technically, the temperature's only gotten to the 90s, but because of all the humidity, it felt like it was way up in the hundreds. So, yeah, it's. I know a lot of the, uh, other parts of the country is a little bit hotter, feeling a little bit more humid, feeling this. Uh, it's just, but here in New Jersey, it's just unbearable. <laughs> so, um, yeah, it was very hot today. Um, we're expecting more tomorrow, or today, or however you want to put it. So, that's that. It's actually very hot right now. Very. It's just, um, it's getting very hot here, and I'm feeling sweat coming on, so I'm going to try to do this as quick as possible. Um, what happened today? Not much. I went to Grandma's house. Um, as I may have told you, Wednesday through Friday, I'm at Grandma's house for dinner and company time and play with the dog and, you know, just take care of things, whatever Grandma needs to take care of. Um, what else? Um... In the news today, um, a very sad story I, I heard on um, the Nancy Grace show. Um, a two-year-old little boy named Emmett was found um, deceased in a wooded, um, muddy wooded area. Um, it's it's drawing some debate as to what's been going on because two weeks ago, another two-year-old little boy disappeared from um, a campsite about, I think they said 37 miles away. Um, but this two-year-old little boy, Emmett, who... Um, disappeared two days ago actually disappeared from his house um, now the whole thing with this story is um, he disappeared while apparently his mom was sleeping his mom was taking a nap and if you're a mother with a two-year-old little boy why are you taking a nap? I mean there's I'm gonna be the first one I'm not a parent Okay, I'll give that much to you, but any parent would know that if you have a two-year-old little boy, don't go to sleep when he's awake, because you never know what he's going to get into. I have a two-year-old little nephew, and his name is Ethan, and he will get into anything if you gave him the chance. And... The problem I'm having with this story is, well, one, of course, a little boy died. No children should die whatsoever from anything. Um, the problem I'm having with this is, one, like I said, the mother was napping. Two, when the Nancy Grace show contacted the mother, um, she said she didn't have a comment. She didn't want to participate in the story, but she also requested that they not run the story. Why? Nancy Grace is a nationally syndicated show, okay? It's shown across the country. As far as I know, it's shown up in Canada, maybe across the world. I don't know. As far as I know, it's across this whole country and it's up in Canada, okay? That is major exposure for your missing child, okay? If your little boy's missing, you want him found. That simple. And you're going to request that they don't do the story? Why? Because you think it's going to make you look like a bad parent? Well, hello, you are napping. Okay? I'm not saying you're a bad parent. I'm saying it was a major mistake, and now look what happened. That's just my feeling. But this little boy, Emmett, when they showed his picture, he's so cute. He's got the blondest hair, and the biggest blue eyes, and the cutest smile, and now he's gone. Um, it's a, it's a tragedy. It's really sad. This other two-year-old little boy who disappeared from a campsite two weeks ago, his name is Siler. It's like Skyler, but it's without the K. Siler. He's still missing. Um, so if you get a chance to look up, um, Siler, um, or a missing child from campsite or anything, please look it up. Look, look at his picture, especially if you're in the, I think it's the Arizona or Colorado area. If you're around those areas, look it up and just take a look at the little boy. Um, on a happier note, um, I'm still in my storage room. I'm still working on it, but I am so close to being done. I'm like this much, 
left. I didn't work on it today because obviously I went to my grandmother's house. Um, I was going to work on it tonight, but I figured talking to you guys is a little bit more important right now. Um, so, but I'm, I'm very close to being done. I'm very excited. I'm so happy. Um, next, um, I'm going to be finishing up my office, which is going to be super awesome. Um, I got a little nicks to work out here and there with my furniture, but I'm hoping that, uh, I'm hoping I can get it done soon because I want to get to work. Um, what else? Um, that's pretty much it for right now. Okay. Um, if you have, um, like I said before, if you have comments or questions, uh, go ahead and leave them. Um, I will give you shout outs if you'd like me to. Um, if you have questions for me, I'll be happy to answer them for you. Um, if you have negative or positive comments, just leave them. You know, so I can read them and see what everybody has to say nowadays. Um, but just uh, keep your hopes up and be safe. And if you're going to bed, sweet dreams. And um, I'll be talking to you guys soon. Bye.